Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today we have an important topic to discuss. How to apply for financial aid on Coursera. Whether you are a student or a lifelong learner, financial aid can make education more accessible. In this video, we will guide you through the steps to apply for financial aid on Coursera. Before we dive into the process, let's understand what Coursera financial aid is all about. Coursera offers financial aid to learners who may not be able to afford courses fees. It provides access to course content and certificate as well for free. Yes, you hear it correctly. You can get any course from Coursera for free using financial aid. Now, let's talk about how to find courses that are eligible for financial aid. When browsing Coursera's course catalog, Look for courses marked with a financial aid available label. This indicates that the financial aid can be applied to these courses. Now, applying for financial aid on Coursera is straightforward. Let's go through the steps together. You can apply during the course enrollment process. Just follow these steps. So, now let's go to the Coursera.org. So now we can search for any courses which we want. Let's search for the courses you want here. I'm searching for data structures and algorithms. Data structures and algorithms. These are the available courses. So let's click on this course. So now if you scroll here, then you can see that here it is written that the financial aid is available. So you can apply for the courses uh, for which the financial aid is apply, uh, available. So now let's click on the financial aid. Now here you can see the specialization is divided into six courses. Okay. Now C for which course of this specialization you want to apply financial aid for. Basically, the whole course is a specialization and it is divided into this six courses. You can think of them as modules. Now you can apply for all of them one by one if you want. So I am applying for the first course and if you want all these courses, so apply them separately in the same way as now we are going to do. So click on next. Now continue to the application. Now here you have to fill the details. So education, you have to select college degree if you are from college or you can uh, click on some college if you are in a different college or you can uh, click on high school as well. So. Uh, let's select the annual income as zero because I want to add a, uh, get this course for free. If you want to pay uh, for some amount, then you can pay some amount there. So now uh, employment status. If you are a student, click on student. If you are unemployed, click on unemployed. Uh, you can click on full time or part time as well. So I will be clicking on student. So now reason you applied for aid. It asks for the reason why you are applying for the financial aid. Now I will be providing all these answers in this video's description. Just note that you have to replace some words like here it is data analytics and I am applying for the course on data structures. So right here data structures and algorithms best you don't have to replace any words from here let's click on i have reviewed my information now here how much can you pay for the selected course i'll be selecting zero now how will you your selected course help with your goals so I'm having this file. I will be sharing this uh, all the answers in the video's description. 
let's copy this and paste it here. So if you want any replacement here, understanding how data structures could potentially use as two kinds. Okay. So in all the places where artificial intelligence is there, you replace it with data structures. data structures here as well replace it with data structures click on the terms and conditions checkbox now right here i agree to the terms above click on I'm not a robot now click on review everything look okay on your application it is asking to recheck it now submit the application so now once you have submitted your financial aid application the next step is to wait for a decision, Coursera will review your application by their end and this may take some time, be patient, they will get back to you in 14 days. So the date is here, October 14, 2023, they will be getting back to you on this day whether your application is accepted or rejected in most of the chances, uh, the most chances are there your applications will be selected or accepted just do the steps correctly now if your application is approved Coursera will notify you on October 14 for me and whatever uh, the date is given here the Coursera team will notify you whether your application is accepted or not so you can meanwhile you can audit the course and you can also review your financial aid by clicking on this so my purchases financial aid it is processing. You can expect to hear from us by October 14, 2023. So that's a wrap for today's video on how to apply for financial aid on Coursera. We hope this guide helps you on your educational journey. Don't forget to check the description for additional resources and links to learn more. Thank you for watching. If you found the video helpful, Please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel and share it with others who might benefit. If you have any questions or queries need to further uh, or need further assistance, feel free to leave a comment below. Stay tuned for more educational content and as always, keep learning. That's it for this video.